Caroline and Catherine Coyer from Villanova. We think of you two together, and here you are, side by side. What's it like to have each other for the experience? Go ahead. I'll go first. Um, you know, I think that going into school, we really wanted to come in together um, just because we'd never been apart. But then there was always the critics that told us, you know, oh, you should be more independent, you know, this and that. But it really has worked out the best for both of us, I think, on and off the court. I think it's been nothing but good for both of us. And in terms of maintaining your own identity, even though you're close, how do you do that? Um, I mean, anyone who knows us well knows that we're very different people. Um, but I think that actually being together at school has helped us a lot to create our own identity just because I think that we give each other the confidence to be like who we are and like accomplish our goals and stuff like that. So I think that it's really helped us form like our own separate personalities. You were the sixth man of the year last year. How will that benefit you going forward? Well, I think that um, a little confidence boost, like six man, never hurt anybody. You know, I think sometimes that's something I lack is confidence. So, you know, it just gives me a little bit more of a boost for myself to just have the confidence to going forward that, you know, even when I'm not shooting well or Harry's yelling at me or whatever, you know, just to take a step back and realize, you know, I'm doing okay. <laughs> Catherine, she mentioned Harry yelling at you. As fans, we watch him on the sideline, and it's entertaining. What's it like to play for him? Um, I mean, it's great. He's obviously one of the best coaches around. Um, he's a little crazy, but we love that about him. Um, and at the end of the day, he could rip you on the court, but as soon as the game's over, like he's like your best friend again. Yeah. And the results are remarkable year after year after year. How would you describe Villanova basketball if you were describing it for someone who hadn't seen it? It's interesting you ask that. You know, I feel like even coming in as a recruit, um, I didn't really even know what I was in for. <laughs> Not in a bad way, but I just didn't really know what to expect. Um, I would probably describe it as very much a laid-back atmosphere, but also a very sh structured offense. And basketball-wise, you know, you have specific um, expectations in your role and everything. But as far as the program's concerned, it's pretty laid-back, and I think we all just like to enjoy each other's company and kind of act like a little dysfunctional family. It's a unique style of play to watch. What's it like to play in it? Um, like you said, unique. Um, I think it's very complex and it's hard to sort of wrap your mind around, so I think that's why most of our freshmen end up redshirting. Um, but once you get it, it's, I mean, like you see why it works so well. As we wrap this up, we're entertained by Coach Peretta's antics. <laughs> you guys are focused on the game, but can you ever steal yourself away from it for a moment and say, wow, that's awesome? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes it's you know, you are so wrapped up in the game, that you're like, what is going on? But um, yeah, it's, it, sometimes, yeah. yeah, you can take a step back and it's, you know, you can find the comedy in it all. And all kidding aside, I think everybody wants to play for a coach that's passionate. At the root of all of it, this is a guy who loves basketball and is so passionate about it. The impact that that has on you a play, as a player, seeing that, what's that impact? I mean, it definitely makes you want to work harder and, um, not just not let him down, but not let your teammates down, because I think everyone sort of buys into the program and buys into the um, everything that he says. And I think it's a really great experience. Great chatting with you guys. Have fun this year. You too. Thank you. Thanks. Tony Luffman, Big East Digital Network.